Hello and welcome to math lesson number 38. So first of all guys, can we all turn and say a big hello to our friends on camera? Hello. Hello. And we'll begin by doing our meditation sequence. So teacher Wes will sit down, straighten his back and we'll take two fingers, find our heart center, left hand on our lap and close our eyes. Okay guys, and when you're ready, you can open your eyes and slowly come back to the room. Very good. Next we'll do our stretching sequence. So everybody please stand up and push in your chairs. And we'll begin by going high, high to the sky. <laughs> Let's have a stretch, high as we can standing up. And then we'll go low, we'll touch our toes. Stay there for a couple of seconds. And next go high again. This time, can we go tippy toe high? Pretty good guys, tippy toe high. And then back down to our toes. Off once again, but this time we'll go side to side. Gently, just give our spine a little stretch, nice gentle stretch for our spines. And then we'll go forward and backward, forward and backward, forward and backward. And how many star jumps? Ten. Ten. Okay, ten star jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent, guys. That's us warmed up for the lesson. Please sit down. The math lesson number 38. But does anybody remember what we've been learning the last couple of lessons? Lessons 36 and 37. Length. Excellent. It's all about length. L, E, N, G, T, H. Length. But what were we doing with length? What were we learning to do? Remember, if, if teacher Wes writes this sign? Plus. Plus. Addition. We were adding together, weren't we? Remember? Adding. 
together. A G G I N G, adding length. Okay. So who wants to try? Me. Okay, down, and then we'll go prayer because they were the first two hands up. We need two examples. Okay. So teacher, where is the first example? Does anybody remember what this means? Millimeters. How many millimeters equals one centimeter? Ten. 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 Okay. Ten millimeters equals one centimeter. So if teacher Wes wants down to add, let me see. We'll go with first of all seven plus eight millimeters equals down can you come and work this one out for teacher so remember 10 millimeters is one centimeter seven millimeters plus eight millimeters 15 millimeters Okay, down, very good. How many millimeters? 15 millimeters. Okay, so what can we do? If 10 millimeters is one centimeter, how can we re-equate this? One centimeter and five millimeters. Perfect, you can write. One, one centimeter, 10 millimeters, but we still have five millimeters. We can't just forget. Excellent, one centimeter. Perfect. You see, these are the same. 15 millimeters means one centimeter, five millimeters. Because when we get to 10 millimeters, we can count it as one centimeter. High five. Round of applause for down. We'll do one more. This time we will do centimeters. How many centimeters equals? 100. 100. One meter, okay. Sorry, 75 centimeters. That's right, Nadia, CM, not MM, plus 54. So, Prel, can you come forward? Can you work this one out for teacher? What do we have, guys? 75 centimeters plus 54 centimeters. So, there you go, Prel. 129 centimeters. We'll see. <laughs> And then we can convert 75 centimeters plus 54 centimeters. So really, it's just like a normal adding equation. We just need to remember the unit of length. It's 75 plus 54. One hundred twenty nine centimeters equals one meter and how many centimeters left over? One Excellent. So what's your answer, Prel? One hundred twenty nine centimeters. Or one meter 
29 centimeters because when we get to 100 centimeters we can call it one meter and we have our 29 centimeters left over Pro, sorry high five and a round of applause for Pro. But guess what we are going to be doing today? We are not going to be adding, we are going to be subtraction, or we can say minus and subtract. Ing, addition or adding, subtraction or subtracting. Okay, guys, well done. So now we've got a song about measurements that we've heard before, but it will just remind us. So now we'll have a look at the television screen. So, guys, please turn your chairs to the TV screen. Welcome back to class. We hope your students enjoyed the song about measurements and it tells them about some of the various forms of measurements such as inches, yards and feet or foot. But now we're going to play a game. We're going to learn how to subtract lengths. So before we start, Teacher Wes will do one example on the board. Guys, if Teacher Wes has 43 centimeters but has to take away 31 centimeters what do I need to do subtract, subtract. we take away take away so we'll start with 43 minus, minus. so we'll say centimeters because 31 centimeters so let's see, 3 plus 1 is 4, is it a 3 plus 1? No. So now I need to do minus, so it's 3 minus 1, 2. And I have to, so you see, what we're doing now, we're doing the opposite, we're not adding, we're taking away. So 43 centimetres minus 31 centimetres equals 12 centimetres. Okay, you understand guys? Yes. Are you ready to play? Ready. Okay. So teachers, what you will need to do is there is a flashcard for this activity with various equations written on. What you need to do is print them off and cut them into individual equations and divide your students into teams. I have nine students. So we'll have who's blue team today? Me, blue. Last time, okay, so this time is blue. And this is black. You want black. So we have blue team and black team. So blue, one, two, three, four. Black, one, two, three, four. Pat, will you be blue team or will you be black team? Blue team. Okay, you can go with blue team. Blue pen for blue team. What color pen for black team? black okay so what we'll do is we'll ask one contestant from each team to come forward are you ready guys blue team down blue team one person come forward black team one person come forward this is not down this is lakau this is pro so you use my pen too. So let me see. What you need to do, teachers, is just choose an individual card for each pair of students and then change the students every time. So teacher Wes will write the equation first.
Are you ready? Turn around, you can see. So what's the equation, guys? 726 meters minus 286 meters. <laughs> What's your answer? 440 meters. Is that right, guys? 440 meters. 726 meters minus 286 meters. 40 meters this is seven but we carry over one so six minus two equals four okay high five high five round of applause for Paul and Lakau and what we do it's a tick for black team black team win that round okay guys so next equation two more students please But Lakau, very good too. You got the right answer. Pro is just a little bit quicker. Okay. Blue team. Blue team, are you ready? Black team, are you ready? Teacher Wes will write the equation in red because we haven't got a red team. We have black and we have blue. So let's see. Next one. Are you ready guys? Turn around, you can look. 509 centimeters minus 102 centimeters. You can help. What's your answer, Pakbun? Down. What's your answer? Is that right, guys? Yes. Yes. Once again, both are correct. High five. High five. Both correct. But I think black team just a little bit quicker. Okay. So another tick for black. Can we have a round of applause? <laughs> so blue team. Bang bang. Blue team. Let's win a point. <laughs> yes. T2 will write the equation in red. So, two for black team. Who's next for? Nadia. So, let's see. Next equation. Okay, two for the black team. Put your pen on. You only need to take your top off when you're writing. It will get dry. Keep your, keep your tops on, guys, because the pens will get dry. Nadia, put your top on. Okay. So turn, face the camera. Are you ready? ready? Are you ready? You can look. 561 centimeters minus nine centimeters. Have a look again, Nadia. 561 minus One minus nine? One minus nine? What 
what's your answer? Five hundred meters. Centimeters. Centimeters. Two, what's your answer? Five hundred fifty two centimeters. You see that one, all we needed to do was nine. We just take nine from one, which we can't do. So we borrow from six, make it five, and this becomes eleven. So eleven minus nine, two, and five, and five. So I think that time, blue team, blue team, high five, high five. But guys, remember to keep your tops on because the pens will get dry if you don't keep your tops on. Okay, so point for a blue team. How many points for a black team? How many points for a blue team? Okay, who's winning? Black team. Pang pong. And who? Net. <laughs> okay, guys. Oh, teacher Wes needs to delete the last one before we can do the, third, the next one. Okay. Are you ready? Look. <laughs> okay, guys, you can look. It's millimeters. 213 millimeters minus 34 millimeters mm What's your answer? Bang bang, what's your answer? One hundred seventy nine millimeters. Millimeters, okay. So shall we see? Let's do it together, ready? Three minus four, we can't do. 13 minus 4, 9. 0 minus 3, cannot do. 10 minus 3, 7. 1. Pang Pong, you were right already. I seen he had 179. He changed to 189 and then come back. So, okay, I see you had 179. High five. five. So what's our answer, guys? 179 millimeters. Okay. So now, how many points for blue? How many points for black? Two. So it's a draw. We're drawing. Let's see. Next one. Who hasn't played yet? Pat, you're on blue team, yes? Okay. Pat and Chu. Pat and Chu. Okay, Chu play again. Black team. Come forward, guys. Chu, Pat, come forward. That one we've just done. Okay. Two hundred and ten meters minus Okay guys, go, go. Not centimeters, meters. Thank you. 
right? Are we right? Look again, guys. Hmm. Hmm. Are we right? Let's do this one together. Zero, zero minus eight, can we do? 10 minus 8, 2. 0 minus 9, can we do? 10 minus 9? <laughs> Teacher gets a point. <laughs> High five. High five. For that one, we'll call it raw. Okay? For this one, both teams get a point, because I think the same time. But you see guys, you have to be careful when you're working. Okay? So teachers, you can see the activity that we're playing in our classroom with the flashcards. You can pause the video and you can play on yourselves for another five or 10 minutes, and we'll continue to play. So see you back here soon. Welcome back to class. We hope your, stu your students enjoyed the flashcard game. And it's a good way to introduce competitive elements and get them learning about subtracting lengths. Our teams enjoyed it here and we had a draw. So now guys, it's time for our stretch sequence. So please stand up and push in your chairs. And we'll begin by rotating our wrists. And back the other way. Can we do one forward, one back? And back the other way. It's hard. And now shake our arms. And this time, let's roll our shoulders. And now, back the other way. Let's take them back the other way. <laughs> and hands on hips. Give a wiggle. Give another little wiggle. And to finish this time, we'll have five claps. Five claps. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. We'll exercise our arms because it's time for our worksheet activity. Now we'll do a little writing. Okay? So now time for our worksheet activity. Teachers, if you can print out the worksheet prior to the lesson, one worksheet per student because they'll work individually. And you can see there is a list of eight equations subtracting length. So just give them to your students. First of all, what do we need to do, guys? Write our names on top and then work your way through the equations. If you need any help, you can work together or ask teacher. I'm here to help too. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Anything you don't know, ask teacher. Yeah. Teacher can do on the board for you. you. You're welcome. And remember, guys, remember about your units of length. Millimeters, centimeters, and meters. Make sure you have the right one. You're welcome. Fish. Welcome back to class. We hope your students enjoyed the worksheet activity and we had fun in our class working out the various equations regarding subtracting lengths. And teachers tell your students too, if they need to do their working out on paper, it's good to do that because it shows that they understand the equation and if they go wrong, you can help them. So well done guys, round of applause. So that's the end of this lesson and we'll see you for the next one real soon. So for now, bye bye. Can we say bye bye? Bye bye. Bye bye.